There was free discussions in Parliament in a week, but no transparent information, public address or referendum on joining the ECM. A year later, when the UK was given the chance of a referendum on joining and expanding EEC in 1975, that's when the debate came public, but still not much transparent information regarding the true agenda and final destination of the EU. Ted Heath, followed by Margaret Thatcher, despite warnings from law lords and members of the establishment, were convinced by the EU that they were joining a confederalist common trading and industry market. The UK first had to align and then eventually deindustrialize the gas, coal and steel industries to attain membership as well as a lot of new other things such as decimalisation of the pound, rise in many prices and changes happening under the noses of the British people.